Hello, it's been a while since the last video. I've been uh, quite busy and didn't have much free time, but here I am, back again. And today I have something interesting for you. Uh, Make a Fabs company reached out to me and asked if I wanted to try their new product. And I said, sure, give me, give me. You are currently looking at Maker Fabs MA Touch Rotary development board. This is of course an ESP32 product that that you can program and use for whatever you want. Unlike uh, most development boards that usually require a case or similar, this product already comes uh, in uh, this plastic enclosure with this nice part making the installation of this product much easier you need just hole to install this in something and product itself is very elegant Of course, my example helped. Originally, a product came with this example, with this nasty text and some gauges. I think this uh, this example is uh, made using LVGL library which I don't like a lot, but that is another story. So as soon as I, op I opened the box, I got a few ideas. Uh, many times I received uh, comments that the boards I use are too small to use in car or in a similar places. And very often that is true. But here, this but here this project have a really nice really decent size and uh, it can be used uh, for speedometer or similar applications however my example today has nothing <laughs> to do with cars my idea was to replace these boring switches with something more elegant so here it is, Maker Fabs MI Touch. What is unique is big display, 480 by 480. Next we have this rotary encoder here. I'm using to set amount of my light. And there is also built-in push button. So I'm using it to turn my light on or off. But if this is not enough, we can also have this touch screen, which can also be used for something. No, sorry, not for something. It is used for to dial also um, value here. And on this side, we have clock, date, seconds and here we can see that it is Monday this is just demonstration example if we want real if we want to use this in uh, like uh, for real and I will use this I will need connect few additional modules for clock I will need to attach real-time clock or use um, Wi-5 to get red data which I don't like anymore I like to use real-time clock chip and for setting amount of uh, light to turn off and on light let me see if I For that I will need 
some kind of relay, but not those me mecha but not those mechanical relays because they are slow. I think uh, this solid state relay will work. But I still still haven't got haven't uh, tested it yet. This board don't have uh, too much additional GPIO pins, so it have only these two connectors, and in each connector you have two pins and ground and VCC, and um, usually these connectors are used for I square C modules, but these pins can also be used for solid states for. Uh, LEDs for any it is normal GPIO open here we have USB C port for programming and here are reset and flash button like always I'm using Arduino IDE to program this I love this clicky sound. Only problem I have with this b uh, was that uh, in uh, examples MakerFab provided, there there was only example which use LVGL library, and example which which is using Arduino GFX library. And uh, I was unable to use that library without flickering. I sent few mails. I also tried to contact the uh, maker of Arduino GFX library, but he haven't responded on my mails. So I did a little trick. Right now, I'm using two libraries. Uh, I'm using TFT SPI library to draw in sprite buffer and I'm using Arduino GFX library to to push that sprite to display and that's it code for this is free I will put it in in description so if you want to build this if you want to use this for something similar this code will also probably work on this MakerFabs board, which I presented you a couple weeks ago. So feel free to use it. I think this look nice. And that's it for this week. If you plan to use this, uh, please also like my video, share my video. If you want, you can buy me a coffee. And if you are new here, please subscribe because I'm trying to reach 100,000 subscribers. And my plan is to reach that goal in two years. So every new subscriber makes me happy. I hope you like my design and that's it. Goodbye. Have a nice day.